Welcome back to the channel. I'm King of Baden. In today's video, we're back playing Jedi Star Wars Jedi Fallen Order. I just realized I don't have as much time to record this video as I thought, but I'm still going to record it anyways, because fuck it, why not? Uh, don't forget to like the video and subscribe. All that stuff helps me grow the channel. And we're going to see if we can get back to the ship before I run out of time for this video. Dumbass, he killed himself. I thought I jumped clean. Oh, actually, that was a weird explosion. So I was in the air and got hit from the ground and then shot to the ground. Ah, that was lucky of him. Okay, let's try and get through this. Wow. The one that likes, <laughs> I hate when that one misses, but like shit, that's almost a guaranteed hit misses, you know? Do not scan any of these. I feel like some of these people I miss, but I don't think it lets you scan if you're not in, uh, or if you're in combat, it doesn't let you scan. Hang on, let me hit this up real quick. All right, that's one way to get in. I feel like they were using this pot to hide box or something, you know? Some an area with the door, a small area with the door, a pot that looks like it has like some heating element underneath it. They they, they could have been a ritual. Yeah, sounds like it. All right, let's see where we can get to. Oh, he died. Okay, cool. All right, let's keep on moving. I don't know if there's any other secrets in this area. I think I got them all already because I found the ones that I had to come back for, kind of. I don't know what's in here. Ah, I remember. There's absolutely no way I'm getting back to the ship before um, before I have to go. But actually, I did see that secret up there on the map. So let's check it out real quick. Uh, what the hell? Basically, any damage enemies to retain. I'm gonna blow up or not? There we go. That was weird. Um, I don't know which one I'm supposed to. Oh, uh, I've never had this. Ooh. Interesting. Okay, which way do I need to go though? Let's see what this way leads. I've actually never done this way first. I know I need to, or generally would have to go into the mines, but if I don't have to, I might as well not, right? And I can go pretty much going back the way I came out, which I think is technically longer. Not what I was trying to hit, but not upset either. Okay. Oh, found a secret going back actually. So that's pretty good. But uh, let's see what we get. It's gonna be lightsaber material. Oh, mantis paint color actually. Charisma, which is an interesting color for a machine, I'd say, or an interesting name for a machine. Usually they say machines don't have personality. And I say machines in this case, because I think machines are gonna be different than droids, but actually, that conversation started right back up at the right or well started up at the right time because we just made it to where we actually need to go yeah and let me stop doing that dumb ass shit of turning what well, doesn't even go the opposite way i just tried to go back the way i came in a very like after i knew i was supposed to go this way too so it really doesn't make sense the fact that i uh went back the other way i can't see okay there we go Magic? Ooh -wee. I definitely didn't know I was going to make that one. Let's see. We're going to have to make our way through this cave also. So. I know some of the fights and areas that we need to go through. And that door is what I want to get open to before I actually leave this area. Ah, uh, cool. I 
feel like the story between the story mode and the second hardest mode there's a pretty big gap at least for how i've played the game for my skill at least yeah never mind <laughs> let me not even talk about the gap in the gameplay because i've already acknowledged how this is not my style of game generally There was a scratch on its face, but it was like super small and barely there. Okay. Yep. I don't know if that was an instant skill point of just uh, pushing it back in their face or uh, I was right there for it anyways. But it'll make sense if it is because it's like it's not it's not like a I don't think anyone's gonna think of this, but it's also a, not immediately obvious to do. I the body got in the way. Okay. I think if I remember correctly, which I know I do. Yeah, we encounter our first purge trooper. Cool. Didn't actually try and kill him there. I think the game just gave it to me. Ed. To be honest, I just took down a trooper wearing black and red armor, the same type from Braca. A purge trooper. Their only purpose is to hunt Jedi. Are the Inquisitors coming? It's possible, but we're far from Braca. They might think purge troopers are enough. Or they could be stalling you on purpose. Stay wary. Interesting. Let's see what we get from these boxes real quick. Oh. All right, then. What do we find? We've encountered our first purge trooper. Yeah, that actually is okay. So it makes sense why they're so difficult for me to fight because I'm also bad at the game, but kind of not really kind of, but still bad at the game and they're meant to kill me. Like that's what their goal is. So also, that's not really a shortcut, is it? Let me see. Cause I don't think this actually gets me anywhere faster, does it? Excavation saw. Yeah, this doesn't get me anywhere fast. I don't know why this is counted as a shortcut. But I think there's something down here that I forgot to look at. Okay. Yeah, I forgot to check this box out when I first ran down. But it's fine because we made our way back anyway, so it's not that big of a deal. Something we can use? A wayfinder's poncho. I never put that poncho back on either because I was wearing the orange one at BD dressed, not dressed, but set up in uh, blue and the ship was probably some shade of black or silver. I uh, don't want to go that way just yet. I'm going to make my way out of here now, which I think. Actually, I don't know where that one leads. I don't recall ever using that one, but I want to hit this one up where the rocky dude was standing. And I'm skipping some of the paths right now, but again, I am in a bit of a time crunch right now because I also want to let my car warm up before I go. Let's hit this. And I think all this means is when I first come back to this area, I'll have to slide down that slide again. Identified you as the Jedi from Braca. They're searching for the Mantis as we speak. Can't you move the Mantis? It's too risky to start the engine. Its power discharge will draw their attention immediately. I'll be back as fast as I can. Yeah, gotta rush back because they can't fly away because that'll draw attention, but they're also closing in anyways. But anyways, yeah, when I go back to when I come back here, I'll just have to slide down that uh ice slide again before i can take the elevator down which is it's not that much more difficult so it's not that big of a deal but still
And I think I missed one of the life things too, because I thought it was in this area, but uh, or on this planet, but I still haven't found it. And I think I know where it is. I just don't think I navigated it properly this time. BD1. I missed something. Yep. Oh, it's just a baton, or is that a rifle? Thanks, BD1. That was a baton. I check up this way this time. I don't think I did. I don't know if there's. I can't remember if there's anything up here. Anyways, no. This is the way down in the first place. I don't know why I tried to block that attack. Okay. Cal, we've got a yeah, no, blah, blah, blah. Here I come. I do know that something that I didn't expect was happening the first time. Is that... Okay, it's not going to shoot. I blocked its attacks too. Which I didn't expect. I thought I was going to have to rush up on it and try and dodge those. Damn. Dodge those attacks because generally. Damn. Okay. Generally, they um are bigger blaster bolts, so you can't just block them. That's why it was an actual issue to have an ATS to fight him. And cut him in half. We scan this? Doesn't look like it. But yeah, there are areas that I missed. I think whatever that is. Well, no, that's I just unlocked that. But there's definitely some uh, areas that I missed back over in this direction. Somewhere in this area, there's something that was missed. Because I remember it was in a real dark area, but I don't know if it was on this planet. I'm still not sure, actually. But anyways, I was rushing to get back here, got back to the ship, and then started just talking. Nice work out there, kid. Hey, we got some real moves on you. <laughs> just tell me that this visit wasn't for nothing. I found the tomb of a Zepho Sage. They definitely used the Force. An advanced civilization of Force wielders who mysteriously vanished. No wonder Master Cordova became so obsessed with them. What else did you find? Before they disappeared, the Zeppo journeyed to the planet Kashyyyk. Oh. Cordova had a Wookiee friend named Tarful. Maybe we can find him. Kashyyyk? I, look, things are really bad down there. The, the Empire's muscling in on those Wookiees big time. Then we better get ready for a fight. Oh. I think this lifestyle suits you. Fighting that walker seems to have made you more confident. So, how are you holding up? I mean, with the Force? Yes, with the Force. I know you said it could be overwhelming. I haven't gotten myself killed yet. I'd rather not talk about it. Yeah, well, I understand. More than you realize. Well, why'd you choose to stop using the Force? When the Purge started, and our clone troops turned against us. My Padawan and I took several younglings and we went into hiding, but we didn't last long. The Imperial Patrol was about to discover our location, so I tried to lure them away from my Padawan Trilla. She stayed behind with the younglings, but they caught me and they tortured me. They wanted to know about the others and how many were left, but Mostly, they wanted to know about Cordova and where he went. But you escaped. No. It was a prison riot. I saw my opportunity, and I took it. But they almost broke me. And I am not the same as I was, Cal. Your Padawan. Did she survive? No. But that's why we can't give up. 
We can't let the sacrifice of those closest to us be for nothing. Okay, well, this video is, I feel like it's gonna be, it doesn't matter. Okay, so this is Terrarium, in case I didn't show it off. And we already have one of our things sprouting up over there, too. Um, otherwise, we gotta get on our way to Kashyyyk, actually. Uh, no, like, no, no. <laughs> this is where we're gonna end the video. So, uh, thanks for watching. Don't forget to like the video and all that. Actually, wait a second, I don't even say that at the end anymore. Let me get the clothes that I had back on too. So I definitely went with this one. Had the desert skin on. Or guardian, I guess is what it's actually called. BD was in this blue. Not this blue though, it's too much. The mantis was actually, I kind of like the charisma one better. That's too dark, I like it's pale. I like the shininess on this one. And this one just kind of changes it from black black on black to uh black with gold and yellow actually looking at the tail like the vertical tail piece looks like there's more than just a little bit of black being added but either way i like this setup better cool all right let's get out of here all right well thanks for watching and i'll see you on the next one